Hi friends, happy to see you all. Today I am going to take a class about many to many relationship. Many to many relationship. In this, we have two things. One is desired objects. And second one is junction object. Okay. In this many to many relationship, we have two desired object and one junction object. What is desired object? Means what is desired object? Desired object means it is a choice to select object to make relationship between each and every record in those objects. That is called desired object. What is meant by junction object? It is just when we are to consider uh, coming to master child, we have parent and child. For single child, we have multiple parents, right? It's not occur right in real time. For a single parent, we have n number of childs. One father have more than one children, n number of children. Where one children have n number of fathers, it not open. Likewise, where child have one relation with a parent class and parent have a multiple relations with child object. Likewise, where in many to many relationship. don't have any parent object and because consider a1 to b1 and a2 to b1 okay a1 to b2 a2 to B2 Actually, consider if you consider this as a child, B as a child and A as a parent, where A1 to B1 is possible, where A2 to B1 is not possible, right? Not possible. That means in it is master MD, master detail, where A1 to B2 possible and A2 to B2 possible. A1 to B2 is possible and B2 to A2 not possible. If you consider, that means single child, one child have one parent and one parent have n of childs. This is not possible in master data relationship, but it is possible in many to many relationship. Let us see how. First, before that, I just want to discuss with you the steps involved. Steps involved in many to many relationship. First step select desired object design two objects. We have only two objects, we have to select object, decide to select and then select create master data relationship MDR from desired objects to junction object third Create records to records in junction object. These the steps involved in many to many. Just follow the tutorial. Just open your log. That means I just log in. I have phones, contacts, and customer. Customer is my customized object. Click. I just want to first that means I selected these two are my two desired objects accounts and contacts 
first step. In my case, desired objects. Accounts and contacts. Junction object. Customers. In my case, consider accounts and contacts are customers. Customers view fields. First, I want to first. What is the first step? Second step. Create MDR relationship to. Desired objects to customer. I just want to create objects called new. I am selecting master data relationship. Next, I want to select account. This is my desired object. Field name. I just want to same thing account. And remember, child records can be reparented to other records after the created. Just I am just enabling this. It is not mandatory. Why I am enabling this? I show you later. Next, next, next is general. No, no need to worry. Save. It's got saved. Okay. Again, I just want to create a new call. Contacts to customers. Okay, master data. That means this is the second desired object relationship. Select now. I want to select next. Same label. I am not enabling this here. Not enabled in contacts. Remember, not enabled for contact. Next. Same. I just enabled. What I will do here? See here. I have records in here. I have two records in four records where A1, A2 is my record. Consider two records C2, C3. Accounts means A1, A2. Contacts means C1, C2. Accounts A1, A2. Contacts. Sorry. C1, C2. A1, A2. I don't have any records. I am just creating a records in customers. What I will do here? I will do customer name as Lakshmi Deepak Department. Software, email, X, something. I is mandatory. But I am just looking A C one. A one C one. C one new. Wasavi. Admin. It is not mandatory. I am just creating. Again, I am selecting A one. In context, I am selecting. C two, C one new. Kumar, I am just selecting K two, C one, C one new. Pawan, K two, C two, C. Let's see. What we have, we have Pawan Kumar Vasavi Lakshmi Deepak. I will show you the departments. Edit columns. It's not there. I just want to show you. So I am selecting contact account. I will. Okay. Now we will see Pawan A one A one C one C one for single parent. For A one we have C one C two. For A two we have C one C two. If it's so, consider if this is a child, C is a child, A is a parent. Can one child have two parents? That means more than one parent? No, it's not possible. So, so only we don't have any parent and child words in technology in many to many relationship. Let us see how to check the many to many relationship. Just go with accounts. Just click on any record. You see, you don't have option to see. This is customers. We have only the names, right? We have only the names of customers. But what I will do here? For A one, we have Lakshmi Deepak and Vasavi. What I will do here? I will go edit below to view many to many relationship. If you an account, you have to select the second column. This means account contact. 
navigate till customer and just click related list properties we have here contact last name contact last name last name that means this what i just filled up click ok here click save and just go here what i will do here see now you have a column called last name c1 c2 again likewise same you have to do open any of the record and just go edit layout first of all you see here you don't have second column i need to come here that is called account name related list now we get customers properties and then we have called account name in customers you have to select the previous object that means the first object desired of first desired object account so you have here right just navigate here for a1 for if you click a1 a2 what about here For C2 we have Lakshmi Deepak and Vasavi. For A1 and A2 we have Vasavi and Pawan for customers. If you click here, A1 Vasavi Lakshmi Deepak. For A2, A2 if you click A2, we'll, I, I, here I selected name called account A1. If I click A2, what I will do here, accounts. A2. For A2, what we have? Pawan and Kumar. See, we have Pawan and Kumar. If I click C1, who having C1 here? Lakshadipak and Kumar. If I click C1, what will happen? It will display the name called Lakshadipak and Kumar. See. This is how many to many relationship will occur. That means for single thing, for C1 we have the Kumar and Lakshmi Deepak. For A1 we have Lakshmi Deepak and Kumar. This is how many to many relationship will be works. That means each and every record have a n number of relationship with other object. In this case we require two desired objects and one junction objects and the records are created in a junction object not in a desired object. Thanks for watching my tutorial. If you like my channel, just subscribe. And more, more just follow me for more updates regarding salesforce.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great time and advance to a happy new year. Take care.